Welcome to the next part of me going through every single card that I'm showing you here from this entire lot I got all from the stores year by year. My next stop will be these two parts right here. This exact lunch and tin. Now, I actually already did a video opening these two, but I want to redo all that. I only know the cards from these packs, so I'm just going to go revisit these. You see, this exact carry tin actually has forms of Necrozma. We have Dawn Wings right there and Dusk Mane. This side has the forms of Lycanroc, Day, Night, and Dusk. And this is part of the trading card game. In fact, this is actually my birthday present from 2018 and got me into the TCG. So we open this up. You read it with this. The two Ultra Beasts forms of Necrozma, Dusk Mane, and Dawn Wings, and the Dusk Leakin Rock with their both the hollow variety, and also for your convenience, a coin. If I can get it out. And this one is a very nice holographic. You can see the some of the diamond sparkles on it. And of course it just acts like a typical coin. And what else you get in here? Five booster packs. I have already opened them, so I only know the cards inside. But I'm going to go ahead and take a look at those cards again. Because I actually know what I got them all. Four pencils. Two are always different from each other. Um, two sticker sheets. This one's for an Acrosma. And this one is for Lycan Rock. A coloring uh, notepad, you can actually write notes down, which is why they gave you the pencils. And, oh! Oh, I actually forgot about this one! It's a card holder! It's a old portfolio. Now, I'm not usually a big fan of these portfolios, for the fact that they can actually get scratched pretty easily, because they're not really the, the sturdiest of all. They can scratch easily, and this can only hold 60 cards. That is, if you're using the double sleeve variety. Uh, in fact, I actually got another portfolio, which I will show in another video, not this one, that it is kind of am scratched up a bit. Yeah, you can see why I'm not usually a big fan of those small ones. And it's also not even not to put in an entire series. Well, it's good for holding, like, a deck of cards, which you need for the TCG and all. But then again, it's not going to be very helpful for you in the long run especially for a collector's point. Well, let's get on to the packs. Two of Ultra Prisms. Two, uh, we have Orange Sky, Evolutions, and Normal Sun and Moon. So, let's begin. First, Ultra Prism. The thing, and another thing I wanted to say, I do not throw away these packaging. I do want to keep them just for authenticity's sake. So this one is a green coat, so we're just getting something that's just normal. And now I need to recognize these. I do want to go at least a little slowly so I can show you uh, the artwork of everything. So it's Ultra Sun, four at the back. So we got Lightning Energy. Pokemon Fan Club, Kranados, Fire Memory, the cards I show you were all the uncommons. These are the common variety, Passamayam, Buniri, Carnivine, Sneasel, and Eevee. And now on to the two special variety, which is the reverse hollow is Shinotic, and this is the rare variety. And the normal rare variety. Aha! It's the hollow variety of Infernape. 
Kind of interesting, I will admit. So that's one pack down. Now on to the second of Ultra Prisms. This one's another green coat, so again, we're just getting something that's traditional. This one is Dark Energy, Luxio, Shield On, Identified Fossils, those are all the uncommons, and here are the normal commons, Bronzor, Gibble, Roselia, Chimchar, and Pachirisu. The two special ones, it's a Reverse Hollow Luxray, and the other one is a Lolan Executor. So that's all the ones that are in the two Ultra Prisms. Next is X and Y, Warring Skies. Ooh, this one is a white code. Okay, so we got something fantastic here. Maybe, maybe not. So from this X and Y, it's three at the back. Starting with the uncommons, you have Silcoon, Ultra Ball, and Pelipper. For the normal common variety, Bagon, Pit of, Ninkata, Swablu, and Voltorb. The reverse hollow is Spiro, which is a common, and the rare. A hollow variety beauty fly with the marvelous scale ability. So that is Roaring Skies. Now on to X and Y Evolutions, which is pretty much the packs from the original starter decks way back then, the base sets and the fossil sets. This one also had a white coat, if you notice. But what special it has? Oh, it is very special indeed. So, starting with Uncommons, we have Magmar, Energy Retrieval, Blastoise Spirit Link. Now onto the Commons, you have Charmander, Magnemite, Water Energy, Growlithe, and Machop. To the two special ones, it's a Reverse Hollow Magnemite, and for the rare variety, Brock's Great Ultra Rare Full Art! Yeah, I got so lucky that I got a Full Art of Brock's Grit in this, in my very first set. Which is this. And finally, we have the normal Sun and Moon variety. This one's a normal green co, so nothing too special. With, starting with the uncommons, we have Dartrix, Alolan Radicate. And wishy washy. Now, going, we got Steel Energy, and into the common variety, we have Firo, Paris, Lillipup, Bounce Sweet, and Dupiter. On to the Reverse Hollow variety, we have Double Colorless Energy, which is uncommon, and the actual rare is the Brushlex. All around, we're very good packs. So that's all I got from this exact lunch tin right here.
Now on to the tin. This one is the one for Latios, but they also make one for Hoopa and the Kraza. And of course, what you see here is the Latios EX card. As you can see right here, Latios EX. Fast Ray and Lightning Pulse and EX rolls. If it's knocked out, the opponent takes two prize cards. 170 HP with Dragon. And also, you always get some booster packs. Two of X and Y Evolutions are Warring Skies. So, let's take a look at each of these packs here. This one is the green variety, so nothing too special about that. Oops. So this one is Switch, Maintenance, the old Brox Grit. This is the just the normal version. Of course, the lunch tin I got the 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 yeah the full art that's the uncommon ones this is the normal commons you have Machop Growlithe Water Energy Magnemite Charmander this is the reverse hollow of Vulpix and the typical rare is the Dugon it actually comes to think of it I think these are the actually same exact cards from the other EX pack I got. Eesh. This one is the next bit of Evolution Sky. X and Y Evolutions, I mean. This one is Super Potion. Machoke. Onyx. Sandshrew, Vulpix, this is the normal one, Electabuzz, Drowsy, this is the reverse hollow of Poliwhirl, and the actual rare is Doug Trio. Wait, wait, what? Oh, there's also Charizard Spirit Link. <laughs> I actually forgot. That's it for that. Now we have Roaring Skies. This one's the white coat, so we got something very special inside this one. This one is, has Shellgun, Switch, Ninjask, Inkay. Took a P. Execute. A uh, two third art of Natsu. And Fletching. And this is the reverse hull of Trainer's Mail. And the actual wear is. Ah! Two third art of Altair. Very nice. Yeah, and that's all I'm going to be showing for the day, is just these two pack, two card slots. Whew. A bit of a doozy one, but I soon did it. You are those two? So that is part two of this long series with the Pokemon TCG openings.